side. First down, Texas Tech. Little shuffle pass to Henderson. Henderson's loose. Henderson's across midfield and goes out of bounds at the 45-yard line. A pickup of 20. They stop the clock, move the chains. Great block by Francis, and Peters got one as well. Francis never gave up on that play, Tim. And this guy, this little guy is a special, special player. He plays so much bigger than 5'9", 179 pounds. Never gives up. Great vision in the open field. So good with the ball. First down for the Red Raiders. Simmons looks left and throws that way. He's looking for Welker and overthrew him. Good coverage. May have thrown that one away on purpose. Well, that was the one thing Wes Welker talking to him about B.J. Simmons. I said, what, what's been the most impressive part about a one-year wonder? A guy that you knew in practice, he said, you know, in practice, you can never really tell someone's decision-making. Everybody makes good decisions in practice. Look at the domination by Texas Tech in this quarter. But he said, I was really surprised at B.J. Simmons and the decisions he makes. And I agree, Tim. There's double coverage over there. You're in no hurry. Second and 10 with a minute 55. It's all the time in the world. Second down and 10. Here comes pressure. Smith's got him. Antonio Smith with a huge sack. You know who made that play? Clay Cole, the nose guard. He sniffed out the shovel pass that was coming, and all he did was grab a hold. Watch Clay Cole right here. This is such a heads-up play. He grabs Henderson as he tries to go by. They're trying to set up a screen, not a shovel, a screen. And that's P.J. Simmons has nowhere to go, and Antonio Smith finishes it. Loss of 15. It's third down and 25. Again, there's pressure. Looks for Henderson. Intercepted. John Holland with the interception, and then will do it. The Cowboys can run out the clock. And finally, the celebration begins. It all starts with pressure, Tim. Greg Richmond, the senior defensive end, who's had a whale of a ball game, applies the pressure. Simmons, on a bad leg, just lays it up. And Holland, the free safety, remember, he got caught earlier on that Torian Henderson. I think all is forgiven right about now by the Oklahoma State coaches. Josh Fields taking the knee. Let that clock continue to tick off. Josh Fields comes up looking. Yeah, he's a little gimpy, isn't he? A little tape on that right calf. Well, give a lot of credit to Mike Leach. You, you mentioned it earlier. They could be up 50, down 50. He looks the exact same, never panics, and the players say that. That his calm and that demeanor rubs off on them. And you, you don't want to fault Simmons either. He was just trying to make the play there at the end. 33 ticks remain. What a play by Clay Coe. Josh Fields no letting the play clock get down inside five. And now he takes a knee. And that's it. And how about those Cowboys? That kid right there is a competitor and a winner. He comes up he short got, today. I'll tell you right now. I have a vote in the Heisman Trophy race. B.J. Simmons just got into the race in my mind. Well, tonight's players of the game are B.J. Simmons. And what an afternoon he had. 42 of 67, 552 yards, five touchdowns and two interceptions. And Tatum Bell, 28 carries, 238 yards and three touchdowns for the Oklahoma State Cowboys. Bell's touchdown, 48, 95, and five yards out for both of those players. A spectacular day, and Chevrolet will make a $1,000 contribution to each university's general scholarship.